I've mapped the sewer entrance from the schematics we found at City Hall. Location updated. USS are nearby. Engage and neutralize them. Try anything funny. Identify yourself. My name's Claire Redfield. I'm looking for a little girl down here. Have you seen her? Sorry. Are you sure she's still? She's special. She survived this long on her own. Her name's Sherry Birkin. Please keep an eye out for her. Ada. What was that all about? Running off like that was reckless and stupid. Those zombies are everywhere. Not to mention that thing that got Ben. I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. But we're not going to get through this alive if we don't work together. Okay? All right. We'll do this your way, Renata. Talk to her. Resident Evil. Don't move. You're the one who did that pop, if I'm not mistaken. Identify yourself. Ada? Ada Wong. Ada Wong. I've heard that name before. Now I remember. One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? It's capable of creating the ultimate bioweapon. Its potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is... Precisely, my husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Where did you get that? It looks exactly like the one I gave Sherry. 
She dropped it. I've been holding on to it for her. Liar! Give it back to me! Too bad. Another spy sent by Umbrella, right? Let me guess. You're here to steal my husband's G virus, aren't you? You are delicious, I'll give you that. Husband? Then you must be Annette. Sherry's mother? What? Sherry's wandering around alone in the sewers. You have to help me find her. That's impossible. I told her to go to the police station. What's she doing here? William will be after her. William? That's right. The creature that's been causing all this destruction is none other than my own husband. Are you telling me that he injected the G-Virus into his own body? The G-Virus has the ability to revitalize cellular functions. So those rats were the carriers of the virus? As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human by now. I tried to save him, but I'm afraid it's already too late. But... And that's not even the entire story. Every G-Virus bioweapon, including William, has the ability to implant embryos into other life forms. That's why he's after Sherry. What are you trying to say? The bodies of individuals with non-related genetic coding are likely to reject the embryo. But since Sherry is his daughter, that possibility is non-existent. It's an inherent survival instinct. Ah! It's Sherry! You go that way. That's my problem, not yours. Fine. Don't tell me. But you better start working with me here. Or we'll never make it out of this alive. Please, Ada. I need your help. I can't do this alone. You're right. I'll help you. Thanks. But first, we need to find the others. That's two I owe you. Don't make 
mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? Never mind. Let's just get out of here. The sooner the better. Fine. Come on, let's go. We finally arrived. There must be something hidden here. Sherry. My forehead's burning up. I've got to hurry before the embryos pupate.
finally awake. Isn't this... That's okay. You keep it. I'm sure it'll keep you safe. Thank you, Claire. Even though... I'm an only child, neither of my parents ever spent much time with me because of their work. I grew up alone, but now that you're with me, I finally have someone to rely upon. <laughs> Sherry... Rest here for a bit. I'll be right back, as soon as I found the antidote for you. Come on, let's go. I'll never forgive you for that. Wait! I've just prepared a sample of the G-Virus. And this time, no one will take it from me. This is the most significant piece of research my husband has ever left in my hands. Stop it! Sherry's in serious trouble. William implanted her with his embryos. There's no telling when they'll pupate. And if that happens, then Sherry won't. What? William... William... You're alive! William! Don't you recognize me? I'm your wife, Annette. Alive. He's getting stronger with each skin he casts off. Sh Sherry! Tell me what I need to know. How can I save Sherry? I have detailed information. Everything you need to know to prepare the antidote is right here. Save my daughter. And tell her I'm sorry I wasn't a better mother. Tell her I love her. Sherry. Uh. Annette! The self-destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self-destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. 